something for you. So I do a show called 5 a.m. Master Scrum. And in that show, there we go. I got my fortune cookie. So we have a fortune cookie. We do fortune cookie Friday. So I'm going to open this fortune cookie. And the way I describe it is agile accountants, which you got to know them. They're like the, the ones that have the checklist and scale and safe and got to do all these things. Otherwise, you're not agile. I'm like, do you even know what that means? That's my thing. <laughs> so these agile accountants put a message in this fortune cookie, which I'm going to open up. I'm going to read it to you. And then what you do is you, based on what it says, you apply whatever's in this fortune cookie. Okay. And you apply it to what your topic was. So here's, I'm opening it up and I'm probably getting my dog who's always on my show watching me with their eyes right now because I just opened a cookie up. So here we go. This is interesting. This is a complicated one. Mines are like parachutes. They only function when they are open. So this is a nice one. So think about this. I can apply this to, to safe big time. Mines are like parachutes. They only function when they are open. Now, how can we apply this fortune cookie to what you had talked about today? Safe will help open up the teams to each other so they can start sharing practices with each other and how they improve their work and also start sharing the vision and go so they have a unified vision. They don't follow the same orders or instructions exactly. They choose their own direction, but they have opened up and they blow up value. Okay, this is not a negative thing like a landmine, but mm -hmm. they're blowing up value in a positive way to help each other build better products rather than with their blinders on running through what directions their product owners tell them to go great and my thought is that you get the way your presentation was you got to be open to how safe can adapt to what you need i heard that through your whole conversation so if mm -hmm. you're not open to using safe or how you might adjust it and you're just oh, we're not going to use safe it's it's no good it can't be used but maybe in, in, in partnership with other things that you have mentioned, that you can make safe or version of safe work for your company. Absolutely. One person I love to quote on this is, I'm not quoting him, but Steve Denning is very well known within mm -hmm. the Agile community and yep. uh, part of the uh, Agile Alliance and, or is it Scrum Alliance? Well, one of the two. And he was initially very much against safe. You could read his post about, it. I think I included it in the participant guide, yeah. but then he had another one that he said, oh, you know what? Safe isn't that bad after all. This was a couple of years after an initial one. You can change your mind about it too. Steve Denning has. There you go, perfect. And I think that's a great way to round up the presentation. 